Hello friends, how are you? Welcome back to my channel, The Rich Post. Myself Ajay and I hope you all are doing great. So guys, in this working video, I'm going to show you how to create the reusable component in Angular 17. So friends, before showing you working demo and code, I must say please post the video till the end and please subscribe my channel for latest Angular updates. So guys, here we go. So guys, first, I will show you working demo. So guys, here you so you can see the table data like one, two, three, and four, five, six. Count six, and some of them is showing the count or numbers. I can show you how it is. See, first, let me show you with some demo. Let me cut, and we will see. See guys, the count is three. Wait, save it. Count is six. You can see that. Is now, I will add one more. Copy and save. Save it. Now I have added the three more. See guys, nine and. The attribute show count is equal to two. So we can see the count as well. Intro number nine. So guys, have you seen? It's work like charm. Let me redo it and save it. And now six. Now let me remove this. Cut and we can see the count is three. Let me add this back. Now it will be six. So guys, now I will show you how this happened. So guys, see first I have made one component name data list. Very simple to create the component like ng space c. Sorry, ng space g may generate space c component space component name data list so guys this is my component the data list in that i have created this html see very simple inside the list i have combined the data like ng for loop item data item department and item name and the ng if count 14 like show height and here is my component.ps file detail list see i have used input and output to active to share the data between child and parent components and very simple guys also you can see i have declared the variable like input data type any input show count false by default and output the calculate count a new event emitter see guys event emitter it's a very good directive of Angular guys it used to communicate the component child to parent like we can bind the click event and send something parent sorry child to parent let me show you this dot data dot length i will show you how and guys now here is my app dot component dot ts file inside i have declared the total count by default zero and here is my data data one and data two 
and the calculate count this to total count this to total count plus count you guys now the main or output HTML template is my app dot data list the component that I have shown you very first the calculate count fill count is the row and data I've shown this data one and data two and guys this is will list from the li that, that will show inside it and his total count all the row count now now i will show you guys see if i will remove this one then i will not get this list count now i can see only three i haven't get this because of remove this the total count see guys the calculate count is equal to cal count event from this this to data to length will save inside total count variable this is my event emitter that I have used inside my app.com.html file with data sharing behavior child to parent very simple guys you can see is output to show the count here this one very simple I just need to add this variable here guys i hope you will like it and after it after this post i will come with reusable component form component that i have that, that i will make very soon very simple guys again i will say very first is my html demo html that i will used in my multiple component via to show the data inside it this is my all the directives and declare variables data show count and the event emitter the calculate count see the calculate count will get each list count and data for ng loop and show count to show how to that list very simple guys so guys have you seen it's work like charm and if you will have any kind of query, session or requirement, then feel free to comment on this video. Also guys, you can contact me by my blog, therichpost.com. Oh, friends, in the end, I must say thank you for watching this video. Thank you. Have a nice day. Take care. Bye-bye.